So I just went to the grocery store real quick to pick something up, and I happened to see these. Kit Kat birthday cake. What? They must have knew it was my birthday. Obviously, they've been out for a while. I just didn't know about these. Have you guys tried them? I'm sure it's just going to taste kind of just like vanilla, but I was curious enough to try it out. I actually got another one for... Um, the doctor I work for because she has a birthday like two days before mine so I thought this would be fun as a gift too for her in her birthday bag but let's try them out Chris is gonna try it with me look how pretty it has rainbow sprinkles and it actually does smell a little bit like birthday cake it, it was good it's definitely different than just plain white chocolate it kind of tastes like vanilla ice cream like cake batter vanilla ice cream with a cone because that that crispy wafer right like the yeah. wafer in the inside oh you're out of focus now no it could be <laughs> <laughs> now it could be because it's hot but it melted really easy in my hand so yeah well yeah that's just that's just here that's just here 120 yeah. degrees yay teeter what you got honey what you oh, got okay, perfect. what you got this is janet's new puppy don't bite in my shoes you stinker but you are right here oh my goodness oh my goodness okay you're so sweet So I left this on my dog's desk because I'm not going to be here for her birthday, but I taped everything to the box. <laughs> These are her favorite candies. Well, this one's not her favorite candy, but I got her one of those birthday Kit Kats too. But these are her favorite. And I saw these. I thought they might be similar to these, so I got them for her to try. Have you guys tried the Skittle gummies? Also tried out a new stew recipe this week in the crock pot, and it actually was very good. The meat turned out super tender. I'll leave the recipe linked below. Guys, I'm here at Kona Grill. I'm gonna be meeting up with my good friend Jennifer. She's taking me for an early birthday lunch. We're gonna go have some um, sushi here at Kona Grill and just catch up because it's been a while since I've gotten to see her. So yeah, really excited to just have some grill time. guys just got out of Kona Grill oh my gosh food was so yummy if you've never eaten there before Chris and I usually will go and get sushi there but today I had the chicken lettuce wraps so good um, I just wanted to show you real quick that she did get me a really sweet gift look at these beautiful new headbands you guys know I love my headbands and she got me some new pearl headbands I love this color it's like a rose gold and then a blue definitely will be wearing those and have you guys seen this on Instagram ads she said it totally works her daughter and her love it it's called the crystal hair eraser by bleem I think is what you call it I will try it out and let you guys know and, and this happens to be for my own 40 ounce Stanley she got me a pink Stanley and I purposely not allowed myself to purchase my own of that because I have so many tumblers and I just feel like I couldn't allow myself to get another one, but to get one for my birthday, I am so freaking excited to carry around my cute little pink Stanley. So she said it didn't come in yet, so I'll be meeting up with her again soon and I'll show you guys when it comes in. With the parents, we're heading to Vito's Italian restaurant. I think it's called Vito's, Vito's Pizza, something like that. Um, Haley and Brian are thinking about using them for their rehearsal dinner, so we're gonna test them out tonight and see if they're any good.
morning. It's actually the start of my birthday weekend. I just went and got my nails done for my birthday. I got like a very fun, bright pink um, French, very Barbie core. Um, my birthday is very much Barbie core this year. Not Barbie themed because I didn't really want it to be specifically Barbie, just really fun, bright pinks and yeah, Barbie core. So I'll show you these a little bit close up in a second, but I just wanted to check. And so here they are close up. So I just did some fun stars in a bright, fun Barbie pink as the um, French tips. I think I actually like this side better. Yeah, I definitely just like the star placement and stuff, but I wanted her to kind of do scattered stars that weren't completely the same, like kind of imperfect and they're perfect. They're perfect <laughs> in my eyes is what I wanted them to look like. So they're so fun. All right, nails check. First stop Sephora, I will show you guys inside what I ended up getting. Got my birthday gift and one little extra. So here's what I chose for my birthday gift this year. It's the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Line. So it comes with this Watermelon Glow PHA plus BHA pore tight toner. I've just been curious about that. And then the Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Nianas, how do you say that? Nianasamine? I probably butchered that. Dew drops. And I swear, I don't know if I've tried these before, but they're supposed to be brightening. So, and I love, of course, I love the pink packaging too. So yeah, I'll let you guys know what I think of these once I try them out. If you can believe it, I did not get any makeup. I just repurchased the Sephora waterproof eye makeup remover. I'm going to try it out again. I got this big size because I used to love it. Um, I've been using the Mary Kay eye makeup remover. I had a very large back stuff, back stock of that because I loved it so much, but I just wanted something that I could grab real quick. Um, so yeah, and now off to Ulta to get my birthday gift. And then when I got home, I opened one of my gifts. It's from my dad who, um, he lives currently in Florida. And this is a picture of him and me and my sisters. It's definitely a favorite picture. One of the favorite, our favorite pictures we've ever taken. And I love that he made it into like this commemorative. It's almost like a, I think it's like glass or acrylic that it's printed on. And then you just hang it directly on the wall. You'll probably see it. It'll probably end up being behind me here with my other art piece that's on the wall there so I'll be hanging that up soon that so that was really sweet and sentimental that he sent that um and then he also sent me a really sweet card too but I really want, quickly wanted to mention I'm I talked about this that I received from Jennifer my friend Jennifer it works it really does work at removing hair now I felt like it worked better in certain areas than others so I feel like if you have like longer hair it's not as good. I felt like it picked up the shorter, like stubbier hair is even better. I might be wrong though, because I still have to keep using this, but this is the crystal hair eraser that I'm talking about. And it really did work the first time I used it on my legs yesterday. So I'm really excited to keep trying it because it's definitely way more gentle than shaving. Um, it just feels like you're kind of exfoliating your legs and then you just put lotion on after and it feels really smooth. So I'll let you know if I keep enjoying this. And I, I feel like when I shave, it does give the like cleanest, softest shade, like feel to my legs. But this is second. This comes second for sure. And I think I'm going to maybe carry this in my purse for when I accidentally miss a spot. This would be perfect to just kind of like buff that off. Hi, you guys. I actually have my Halara, Halara, I forget how you say that. Um, the little cute tennis skirts that have the shorts underneath. The best thing um, that I discovered this summer, for sure, I'm gonna be wearing these all summer. They're so comfortable. Um, anyways, I'm kind of at <clears throat> I'm kind of at a weird angle because I'm filming in Chris's car, and you're kind of just like propped up on something. But I'm so annoyed. I went to two different Ulta's to get my birthday gift, and they're sold out. I mean, it's a stupid little Redken hair sample, so I'm not gonna go to any other Ulta's for it. But Ulta, get your act together. Like seriously, that's ridiculous. What, what is like the fun in, in going to get your birthday gift if you don't have the right stock and it's not even that grand of a gift? Just saying. Um, but it was like National Lipstick Day and so I really wanted to try this e.l.f. 
hydrating core lip shine in ecstatic because it's supposed to be like the Clinique black cherry and right now I'm just really into that like lip stain like I have on the Jaclyn Hill lip oils right now um, so let's try this in a second actually let me just show you what else I got I got two Morphe lip liners too because they were like buy one get one or something like that or both 40% off that's what it was they're 40% off um, this was, I think also 40% off. This was not on sale. It's just really affordable and I needed it. It's my micro brow pencil. Um, and it's the NYX brow pencil, micro brow pencil. I'm in brunette. I'm like so off camera. It's so weird. Okay. Let me open this lippy and then I'm going to go inside Old Navy. Chris is actually inside Old Navy right now looking for shorts. We went to Kohl's and it just was not a win. And we have, he hasn't really ever shopped um, for shorts at Old Navy, I don't think. So, curious. I don't have a lot of makeup on today, by the way. Um, this is what I wear on, like, the weekends. I have, like, a little bit of concealer under my eyes. Then I just dusted my face with, well, I put sunscreen on, too. Then concealer under my eyes. A little bit of powder. Um, whatever I had left on my blush brush from the week. Not gonna lie. That's what I put on my cheeks. Put a lip stain on, a little brow, um, gimme brow through my brows, and then I did do mascara. I don't think I did anything on my eyes today. Sometimes I'll do like a um liquid shadow or something. Okay, this is so cute. It has a heart. You see the heart? It's so pretty. I'm probably Ooh. A little darker than I thought it's gonna be because the Clinique one is actually less pigmented than this this one has some decent pigment so no saw mmm kind of has like a melon scent to it oh I really like these it was like five bucks all right what do you guys think it's very similar to the Clinique black cherry okay I need a I need something to wipe this off on now. Still mad at you, Ulta, though. But Elf, I'm not mad at this. Also, you need to sign up for the Jack in the Box app to get two free tacos for your birthday. Um, they'll have it in the app for you. A lot of these things you will need to kind of sign up for the birthday rewards or you need to have the app, like the Krispy Kreme one. I did have to have an app for that, but I mean, you're getting free food, so who cares, right? Simple as getting the app and you get some free tacos. Love them or hate them. I really love them, obviously, because we're going to eat some of these right now. So my birthday started out with these beautiful birthday roses from Chris. They're making my morning so special. I love how beautiful the vibrant colors are. Like, look at this beautiful yellow with a little bit of red. And of course the pinks are my favorite because I'm a pink girl, but these made me extra happy this morning. So I just picked up two of my birthday freebies for my breakfast. No, I am not fasting today. Usually I do intermittent fasting. Today is my birthday, so I'm just enjoying um, pretty much all day long. Okay, so we've got, I did a venti, but I usually do a grande. This is the iced brown sugar oat milk espresso with vanilla cold foam on top, but I got a venti for free today. And then Chick-fil-A, I'm a part of their rewards program. And usually for your birthday, you get like a cookie or a treat, like a dessert. Well, because I am in the reward program and I'm like a little bit elevated, I think I'm like a red member. They have different tiers. They gave me a free eight count chicken or a free chicken sandwich or a free breakfast entree. So I went with a breakfast entree. If you've never tried these, they're so yummy. They're the, just these little tiny little chicken biscuits and they come with four of them. How absolutely beautiful does this drink look? It is a Barbie drink for sure. So this is a strawberry horchata chai from Dutch Bro. And I did have their version of cold foam, um, like sweet cold foam on the top with some cinnamon. Make sure if you love horchata that you try this. It is literally tastes like a liquid dessert. It tastes so good, and yeah, new favorite drink. Okay, I just finished doing my birthday makeup. I actually need to put my gloss, my Barbie lip gloss, I call it, on. It is the sparkly, most Barbie lip gloss. I absolutely love it. It's by Too Faced. I'll show you in a moment. Um, I'm feeling like I'm being a little washed out right now because this lighting is kind of harsh, but 
I definitely went a lot more pink toned with everything. Um, and then my dress is from Abercrombie and Fitch. Holly, honey, you can see. It's so flowy and fun. And then these shoes I'm gonna have to take off and show you. They're so comfortable. They're from Michael Kors, the shoes. Let me see if I can take one off and show you. So they go around your ankle like this. They got a little platform. Aren't they so girly and fun? Um, and this dress, like literally, I don't think you guys, hold on, let me push. I'm gonna pull it down like this. Excuse me, baby. There, you can see it a little bit better now. It has a cute little slit action too. And then see how cute the shoes are. All right. Eyes back up here. <laughs> Just kidding. All right, I'm clearly feeling the birthday vibes. But I've got to get going because my parents are actually going to pick me up for the dinner. And then Chris is going to drive me back home. Let me show you the fun cake pops. Did I show you the fun cake pops? I don't think I did. Hold on. Now that I'm thinking about it, I might have already shown you. They're from Mar They're by Mary Poppins. Look, this is the one that's like a little birthday cake in the shape of a heart. So cute, right? And then we've got some leopard print ones. We've got some very sparkly Barbie core kind of looking ones. And then we've got these heart confetti look spotted ones. Cute, right? And they all taste like confetti 